Hi everybody. It's sunset here. Sunset time. A little after seven. Um, been working on the the footings all day. Um, just wanted to give you a brief update on a couple things. Um, I'll show you some pictures of footings. I've got uh, two of the plates bolted, all cocked. Um, they're in place. Uh, the third one is uh, got the uh, the bolts in, and I hosed it off and cleaned out all the holes and and uh, pounded the bolts in, and. Uh, it has to dry overnight to do it. Um, it's a, it's not a one day one day job for me, anyways. Um, what I've been working on it four days now, really three and a half. Uh, it's really um, I don't have one of those fancy hammer drills. I just have regular drills, so it's taken it's taken me a while to to drill into the concrete and. Uh, of course, before I do any drilling, I remeasure everything again and again and again. So um, I'm doing it right. I'm guessing uh, by next weekend, I'm going to take a couple days off this weekend and do regular uh, ranch stuff. Um, if I don't get my garden in, I'm not going to have one. So I need to get that done, finished up. I've got it, all the soil and stuff like that prepared. I just have to till it and. Uh, lay out the uh, soaker hose and uh, it's good to go. Um, Sage, um, her wound is doing uh, better. It's about the size of a, a flattened quarter, I guess, <laughs> would be a good way to put it. Um, uh, it's been five weeks, almost six, it'll be six weeks on Sunday when she got uh, injured, when she got bit by the snake and uh, that thing is still not healing. Um, I've got another uh, torn spot on uh, Jay now, her front right leg up at the shoulder area. Uh, she got a piece that uh, I don't know what she did. I just noticed it this morning. So we're keeping a sock on her now and uh, getting the uh, Neosporum and stuff on it regularly, keeping it dry, keeping it clean. Yada da, yada yada. I'll keep an eye on it the next few days and see if she needs to go to get the vet to get some antibiotics. But it already looked better tonight when I uh, when I redressed it. Um, it was, seems like there was something else I was going to talk about. Um, I don't think I ever gave you an update on the uh, composting toilet that I put into the to the rig here. I absolutely love it. It's great. Um, no chemicals, no smells. Um, I dig a hole and get rid of it. So it's uh, it's working out real well for me. I love the fact that there's no chemicals or anything like that, and no chemical smells and uh, no poop smells, <laughs> which is wonderful. Um, Abby seems to be uh, taking a step back these last couple of weeks, um, more dependent on me and trying to be less independent, which I'm trying to turn around with her on our walks and her training. Um, I don't mind her leaning on me, but when we're on open road or uh, a dirt road or something like that. I do want her um, to be independent. She's young enough and uh, um, I just think it's a quality of life thing. It's not quantity, it's definitely quality when it comes to her. Um, everything's keeping up uh, fine. Uh, 
Of course, I'm disappointed about the barn and the roof and stuff like that. They've got you know, a half a roof. If we get any rain or anything like that, um, if we get a good wind, I know it's probably going to blow the rest of the way off, but um, I can only do what I can do. Um, I am going to put a link to my Amazon wish list if you if you wish to look at it. Um, it's uh, it's interesting. I don't know. <clears throat> you know, I chose I chose this life, and I love this life, and. Um, it has its definite challenges and stuff like that. My my hands and my back are absolutely killing me after these last three and a half days of working on the the footings. Um, it's it's a uh, it's amazing um, what ooh, a per, a person and uh, I'm not a young thing anymore. Um, I'm out here by myself, and um, I, I'm, I'm sure I've said this before. It wasn't planned that way, but uh, um, I wasn't supposed to be out here by myself. Uh, but I've been here since March of last year and uh, making a go of it. And I've had some really helpful people, and uh, I've had some really bad... Uh, bad breaks, but uh, that's not going to detour me from being out here. It's it's a beautiful, beautiful place, and and uh, it's home, whether I'm in this RV or I'm, if I get the house up, <laughs> in, a, in the next three, four months, um, I was going to, uh, when I got the arches up, um, pull the RV into it just so that we were in the shade for the summer and stuff like that but with the issues that I've had uh, with the slab and the um, I don't think it's a wise idea for me to put this big rig on that slab I don't think it's already got cracks in it um, I'm going to use it as my floor just because I have to, um, but um, in the house. But uh, it's <laughs> it was not done well, and uh, I only have myself to blame on that, um, which is you know old news. So um, I really appreciate the people that are watching my videos and have. Uh, subscribed it's really really going to help us out here if you subscribe to the channel and uh, like the videos and uh, I'd love to see a, a comment on the actual videos and not on Facebook Facebook doesn't uh, qualify as a, a like and uh, it, it calls when you when you follow the link when I post it on say Facebook um, and you watch it it counts as as a watch but if you like it from Facebook it doesn't count as a as a like on YouTube so um, if you go watch watch the video like the video subscribe to the channel that would be so much help. I have to hit that thousand mark, thousand uh, subscriber mark before um, I can start uh, look, seeing any revenue from uh, sharing this journey. I think I got caulking on my chin. <laughs> Splattered up in my face today. <laughs> um, I, I, you have to hit you have to hit at least a thousand people uh, subscribe to your channel before you can um, even think about in, any revenue or anything like that it's it's the subscribers and it's the views that count um, not necessarily in that order so please like the videos on the YouTube channel
subscribe to the channel. If you really like watching me rambling and stuff like that and the and the silly th places that I get and the, <laughs> the challenges that I <laughs> I do overcome them. Uh, if you haven't noticed, I do overcome them. Um, it's a it's a blast out here and I would like to see some visitors um, if you're passing through or or uh, Laughlin's just an hour from here uh, I could even drive to Laughlin and, and grab a bite to eat or something with you um, that would be awesome um, Needles is a little far Havasu I can even do Havasu Lake Havasu City that's not bad at all um, <coughs> What is it, you guys? I don't see a dang thing. All right, that's enough. That's enough. So anyways, I think that's about all I got. Uh, enough ramblings. I'll show you pictures of the, of the footings that I have uh, bolted down and stuff. And uh, thanks again. Bye for now. I'm going to finish my beer.